Hello there, everybody. It is me, Freezer Bunny, and welcome to episode one of Let's Play The Sims 4 Outdoor Retreat. Okay, guys. So it looks like we have a brand new screen introduction when we first open our game. As you guys can see, we have The Sims 4 Outdoor Retreat Game Pack. And let me just read you guys the description really quickly. Okay. New items are available in your game. To find your items, look for the gold flag icon in Create a Sim or Build Mode. Okay, so Outdoor Retreat is of course a game pack released today a couple of hours ago 12 midnight on January 14th and as you guys can see we have new animations and stuff to open up the loading screen Okay guys, so we have the bear opening up the canister or like I don't know what it's called but I think that's a bear costume and I'm really excited you guys and we have some sims getting all itchy and stuff so what I'm actually gonna do is head right on in to create a sim and I will see you guys there in a little bit okay guys alrighty guys we are back in create a sim and okay let me just make things clear okay so this is going to be a separate LP from my sims 4 let's play um, which began a couple of months ago when The Sims 4 was released. So, this means that I'm going to be having two Let's Plays of The Sims 4 on my channel. Okay, guys? And, by the way, since this is going to be a brand new Let's Play, I decided to start off with a clean slate and look for a nice little family here that we can play with and all that good stuff. Okay, guys? So, um, I'm actually... Oh, they're really pretty. But anyway, um... Actually, I'm going to go to, uh, let's see here. So I am in the community and I'm going to go to favorites of all time and then by maxes so that, you know, and of course households as well, because we're not necessarily interested in lots and stuff. OMG, I can see live simmer sim. Yay. And let's see here. Um, I'm looking for a household of like multiple sims and stuff so that we have we kind of have diversity when it comes to the sims that we're gonna be playing with oh oh my quite large um crumple bottom oh my god I have a soft spot for mrs. crumple bottom I think she was my first ever sims 3 sim that I oh, played but I actually kind of Connor um there's three of them which is great um Okay, awesome, awesome, awesome. So, um, actually I'm gonna be taking this family. I really, really like them. They look really, really cute, and she's really pretty as well. But anyway, um, downloaded 600, almost 7,000 times, and it has been made by Gamer15Kid. So I just want to give credit to whoever made this family. They're really, really awesome, and thank you so much for making such an awesome family, and I will be taking them for my LP, so I hope you don't mind. Anyway place this household and we are going to replace and then yes alrighty guys so I did scan a little bit um, just the female clothing and they are really really awesome you guys I love I love the female clothes okay so every time you get a new game pack is what it's called you're gonna have new content that are gonna appear on the upper part of the screen we're gonna see that in the mail section later when we discuss them and when we see the all the items and stuff but you guys can see that once they're done um they kind of go everywhere if you get if you guys get what i mean everywhere in the category but we do get to have like these new tags actually to um to mark all the different content items that came with the, the um well it's not an expansion pack it is a game pack okay guys so okay that was the first jacket that we saw and then this is the second one which i freaking love oh my freaking goodness i adore this shirt like seriously though can we like not and then this is the third one which is also freaking gorgeous love it and it comes with many different patterns and colors and stuff and then i think there's a couple more okay there's this one really really simple kind of reminds me of like a medic uniform or something something in the medicine career and then we have this really really modern high neck high collar shirt really really modern but as i've said i am freaking in love with this shirt are you freaking kidding me this is kind of like amazing but yes that we're taking it okay and then 
um we also have some new hair oh my god you guys yes we have some new hair that came with outdoor retreat so um let me just take off her hat by the way by the way we have some new hats as well so we have this one really really cool and then we have this one and then this one which i really really love it looks really really it looks really posh and it looks really rich as well so um okay let's move on with the hair which by the way i am freaking happy about because we get a ton of new hairstyles starting with this braided one which is really really cute very german looking which i think fits in very well with the alpine kind of atmosphere of outdoor retreat this one i adore like seriously very free flowing i think it frames her face really really well and i think it looks absolutely gorgeous i love it to death it's my favorite hairstyle and then this one is actually a braided ponytail really really fancy as well i like how clean her face looks and i don't know it just looks really cute and then this one we have some pigtails also adorbs and i can see children wearing that and then this one which is also probably my second favorite i don't know it just has a lot of spunk and of course it's a freaking ponytail who doesn't love a ponytail but i'm gonna give her the really long luscious hairstyle that is this one okay guys so i'm fine with her makeup let's just go to her accessories i think we have a pair of socks that came with outdoor retreats so i'm gonna show you guys that these ones awesome 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 and then we are gonna go to the bottoms which um a lot of bottoms actually came with outdoor retreat as well this shorts really really plain but it comes with an awesome belt which we cannot see this one which i love these are the barely there shorts that i'm like freaking dying over which i'm probably gonna give it to her later on once we see all the other bottoms another sh pair of shorts and then this one is a little bit more baggy easier to go hiking in and then i think we have a pair of pants there we go nice little pair of pants as well which i think you can actually i think you can actually unzip these and then they they can be shorts well you know in real life i mean but anyway not in the sims um like the skirt but it didn't come with outdoor living i just had to click on it but anyway let's just put these on her um really like how the blue looks kind of like a flag almost oh my god i forgot to check out whether they have like new accessories and stuff i mean new necklaces and i don't think they have yeah it don't it doesn't look like they have but anyway whatever let's go to um her footwear and of course oh my god you guys i love the fact that outdoor living came with tons and tons of new shoes and they're all freaking fabulous i love each and every one of them so these are all the new diff different shoes i love these ones oh my god like seriously i would totally wear that if i was a girl like yes uh -huh. um this one i also freaking love and then and then also this pair i love i would wear these if i was a guy i, I mean well i was i would wear this as i am now which is a guy yes <laughs> I'm sorry guys literally um, it is freaking 2 a.m. in the morning where I live because this was released during midnight and it took forever to download so I'm just yeah huh. ba basically what I'm trying to say is that I love the shoes yes I love each and every one of them I also love these ones and then these ones and then I didn't do any commentary on them but I love each and every one of them but I think what would fit in with her outfit most is this one. Yes. Yes, it does. And I actually don't mind it in the black. What do you guys think? Um, well, let's go for that. Awesome, awesome, awesome. And I am not going to change her formal wear. So that's how it looks like. This is how her athletic wear looks like. Really, really athletic looking. Awesome. Sleepwear. Party wear. Oh, it looks like she's wearing the same shoes. And then for her swimwear, okay, I'll take it. Awesome, okay. And it looks like she has uh, some earrings, actually, which I don't want to have. All right, so that's really, really cool. So that is how she's going to look like. By the way, what's her name? Elizabeth Connor. And it looks like she is, um, I'm guessing she's related to Ellie Connor and... 
Um, Jason, how is she related to Jay? I don't know. Okay, so I think I have an idea what's going on here. But anyway, um, let's save that for a little bit. <laughs> but anyway, this is how she's gonna look like. Um, she her like her lifetime wish is to become a master chef, and then her, she gets the by choosing this lifetime wish, she gets the bonus trait of the essence of flavor. And then she is a snob, foodie, and creative, which I think are going to be working really, really well with Outdoor Retreat. So yeah, actually, let me change that into... I think that works better. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Okay, so let us move on to the menswear, and let me see how he's related to... <gasps> yes, you guys, so it looks like Connor and Jason DiMarco are married, and oh my god, you guys, this is like some recurring thing happening in my LPs because I also have another gay couple in my other LP that just got married um, a couple of days ago. I just recorded the wedding part, so it will be probably up right now, so you guys check it out. But anyway, um, I love how I constantly have gay sense, and this is the first time that I'm seeing the male the male content. I was too excited. I couldn't wait for the females, but this is the first time that I'm going to be seeing the male content. Okay, so it looks like they came with two different hairstyles i think i'm gonna give him this one because i think it makes him look like his sister i love both of them by the way did he come with some hats oh yes he also came with some hats i think i'm gonna give him a hat what do you guys think um i don't know maybe if something works with his oh my god that covers his face okay this one didn't come with outdoor retreat okay Okay, so for the men, we have two new hats. Awesome, awesome. And then, actually, let's just leave it like that. Maybe we can give him some piercings or something. Oh my god, he is a bad boy wearing pink. Awesome. Okay, whatever. That's gonna work. What's his name? Ellie Connor. And let's talk about his traits in a little bit. Okay, so let's move on to the upper part of the screen and see... The new items that came with Outdoor Retreat. Okay, so this is the first jacket. Love it. We have a tank top. <gasps> oh my god, you guys. And it's ombre. And it totally reminds me of the tank top. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is like really hot. Um, it just reminds me of the tank top, which, by the way, I freaking love. And miss from The Sims 3. Um... From the Sims 3 Island Paradise, especially in this color. Okay, we have a jacket like this one. Really, really fancy. Awesome, awesome. I would I would wear this myself. Then we have this one. Oh my god, this one looks like a fisherman's outfit. Oh my god, really cute. And then we have this one. And then we have this one. Okay, here's the thing. Since he looks like he's a surfer dude, I'm gonna give him the tank top. Yes. And it looks like he has the bods for it too, so... Totally, totally, totally. Okay, and I think I'm gonna put it in these stripes, which I think are actually quite interesting. And in this color, I think, um, I'm not so sure. Let's make it that. I don't know why. I just really like the yellow stripes. Actually, let's make it, uh, I'm not so sure. I like each color. Let's just make it purple. No. I don't know. We'll make it that for now, and then we'll decide later um, once we decide on what he's gonna be wearing for his bottoms. Okay, scroll up. Like I like I told you guys earlier, when you scroll up, every time you get some new um, game packs, I guess is what it's called. The new content items immediately go on the upper part of the category. So yes, okay. These are his new shorts, cool beans, and then we have some new pants, and then we have some other shorts and then some other pants and then these ones as well which are kind of like capri type pants i think i'm actually gonna put some i'm gonna put these on him yeah i think it looks best um in this color actually what do you guys think um i don't know i don't think anything works with his top hmm Let's make it that. Whatever. Let's let's make it that. Whatever. I think it works. And of course, new shoes. Yes. And this is the men's shoes, you guys. So I'm probably going to love each and every one of them. Okay. So I think these are very similar to what we have for the women. So yes. 
nonetheless i love each and every one of them so oh my god especially this one this looks really amazing um i don't know what i'm gonna give him though because we really can't see anything with those pants so um let me just see whether we can choose actually let's go for these ones i think it works better with his top hmm, i think what does the other short looks like what does the other pair of shorts look like hmm let's see here yeah i like the other one better looks more appropriate when it comes to hiking and all that stuff um i i really like the blue color actually surprisingly um if we make it this color and then change his top into like the purpley one or like something that has green on it yeah like that and then yeah i like the top and the bottom um let's just make sure that his shoes match looks fine yeah i think i like these shoes better um or maybe these ones oh i love these um Oh my god, these are actually really, really cool. And then I'm just making sure that I'm not missing out on any options that I might regret later on. These are also freaking cool. I think I'm gonna give him these ones. And maybe just put some socks because, he, I don't know. Every time I put shorts on my sims, I'm like, oh my god, what if their legs get stung or something? By bees or something in the woods. Oh, we also have these socks. Okay, awesome, awesome. Ah, uh, yeah, I think it's gonna make him look weird. Let's not. It makes him look like he's gonna play soccer or something. Okay, never mind. So that is how he's gonna look like. Very, very um, outdoorsy looking, I guess. If we can change the shorts. Okay, whatever it's gonna be green actually let's make it black i think the black one works but i'm like so indecisive yeah i think the blue one works really well and then um with his tank top makes him look like he's gonna go to bed though this is so this is so difficult okay let's make it like that and then maybe we can change the shoes into a nice blue color Okay, that works. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. Uh, can't decide. I can't decide. I'm gonna go for this one because I like the combination between blue and yellow. I think it looks awesome. And then that's his formal wear, athletic wear, sleep wear, party wear, and then swim wear. Which I hate, by the way. It looks like crap. No offense. I think the game just randomly generated this outfit anyway so let me just take off his shirt yes <laughs> that didn't sound right <laughs> yeah sure whatever and then let's give him the blue shorts i think would work well on him these work really well on him okay i guess or actually just these ones nope that doesn't work um let's just give him that okay guys awesome 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 now we're going to dress up jason which oh by the way ellie is a musical genius that's his lifetime wish let's change into his everyday he wants to be a musical genius and then um his bonus trait is a muser and he is creative a bro and ambitious awesome bro as in pewdiepie okay so this is jason right and this is ellie and this is Elizabeth. Okay. I'm kind of getting their names right. Okay. Starting to get to know them better. Okay, let's look for that other hairstyle. Of course, I'm totally going to be using the other one on him. Uh, oh my god, he looks really weird, actually. <laughs> you know what? I'm going to go with it. I think maybe he's going to look better with facial hair. He has really, really red hair. Oh my god. <laughs> What do you guys think? I don't mind the facial hair. I think it's kind of a thing anyway. Um, you know what? Let's not put any facial hair on him. Maybe some stubble. I think the stubble works really well. Okay. Awesome, awesome, awesome. I think we can even like put a hat on him or something. 
Nah, the hat just looks really weird. Okay, awesome. Let's give him... Um, I already have an outfit in mind. Um, I, I really like the one shirt earlier that I said looked like a fisherman's outfit. So let's give him that. And I honestly don't mind the blue color. Um, but yeah, it's a little bit... The other guy was already wearing blue. Um, I, I don't want him to be wearing red like all the time though because he already has like really really red hair so you know what whatever I think this one actually looks really cool and then I want to give him some capri pants or like some rolled up jeans or something I don't know does this come in black yes it oh my god this that, that does that didn't look right um you know what, whatever. I think I'm gonna put the blue one on him. Yeah, I think the blue one looks really, really cool. Um, whew, I can feel my voice beginning to, yeah, crack and stuff because I've been talking for so long. Okay, let's put on... Oh my god, I can't decide. I'm so friggin' indecisive. Um, I really like the blue one. Yeah, well, I'm gonna go for the blue. And then maybe black pants to match his sleeves or maybe the other capri pants what do you guys think literally the same color this one looks a little bit better with his outfit actually does this come in red uh oopsie never mind um accidentally clicked on something yeah i think this one looks best in black and then for his shoes i'm gonna give him uh some really long kind of boots almost i think these ones work actually I have, i've been um these were the ones i had in mind when i was thinking about his outfit um so i think these ones work and surprisingly it looks like these are the first long boots that we're gonna have for the men so interesting actually i'm just gonna base this color scheme on the outfit itself so we're gonna give him this one because i think it matches the boots and then the pants are gonna be green or brown let's make it brown oh my god he kind of reminds me of peter pan which is also really cute okay and maybe we can give him some gloves if we have do we have gloves nope we don't never mind okay so that is going to be his everyday his formal wear oh my god awesome formal wear um athletic wear sleep wear and party wear and then for his swimwear it's going to be um I'm gonna make it uh, like this color because so I think it matches every other thing that he's wearing alrighty guys so that is going to be it for our sims okay guys and I will be seeing you when we move them in to the new world that came with uh, outdoor retreat which is granite falls okay guys I'll see you in a little bit Okay guys, it looks like we are in the moving process um, where we get to choose a house for our household and as you guys can see, we have a new town available uh, which is the world of Granite Falls which it looks like we cannot move our sims into actually surprisingly I'm finding out just now um, yeah I'm clicking on it and it doesn't look like it's gonna let me move the sims into so I'm getting the assumption that Granite Falls in, in, is an exclusively vacation neighborhood and stuff so anyway let's just find a place where our sims can move ideally um, somewhere we can afford uh, so it's either going to be in Willow Creek or Oasis Springs. Um, I think I'm going to choose Willow Creek because actually Oasis Springs. Never mind. Let's let's live in Oasis Springs. Um, so yeah, well, actually, while we're here, let, let me read you guys the description of Granite Falls. Okay, so Granite Falls, travel to, th to this world must be booked on the phone or computer okay well since every sim has their own cell phone i think it's completely overton and west oh my i think we can actually oh wow i'm surprisingly like uh Oh my god, I think we can actually interact with some of my LP Sims, which is are awesome. Yes. Okay, ag ag Agave Abode, um, which costs 18,409. 18, and uh, 
one bedroom one bathroom interesting she is gonna have to sleep in the couch <laughs> that is so mean but i think any girl can handle sleeping in the couch anyway nick stone one bedroom one bath let's go for agave abode how much money do we have um i think this one looks a little bit pr prettier and we're gonna purchase it furnished which means we're also going to be having um, an excess money of 5,000 simoleons. Okay, guys? Alrighty, guys. We are home. And it looks like we are moving in with a fourth member. No, I'm kidding. Who is he? Is he Landon? Yes, he is. And he just came from his wedding, obviously, because he's wearing a tuxedo. Whatever. Um, yeah, sure. Ah, uh, yes. Okay. So, this is going to be our new house. And, um... Yeah, it's really really exciting um i think there's actually space oh my god yes you guys two bedrooms so this means that she gets to actually have her own bedroom as well so while we're here what i'm actually gonna do is do an item showcase for you guys and see what items came with outdoor retreat oh my god and it looks like it came with a couple of brand new room options okay we have the natural washroom rustic sensibility grunge retreats Fab Plaid Commons, Lumber Living, and The Great Outdoors. Okay, I'm pretty sure you guys will be seeing these um, in other people's LPs and stuff. But you guys can see that every time there is a new item in a specific category, that item will be highlighted. Um, wall patterns, for example, we have new ones. Let's see here. I wonder where they are, though. Let's go to... Okay, we have three new wall paints. I'm pretty sure we have a couple new floors. We have one new floor. We have new trees. Yes, as a builder, I love having new trees. So, yes, thank you so much, EA. Um, and then we have a new column. Okay. Okay, I think that is actually it for what we have in build mode, which is a couple of items. I'm really, really happy about that. Actually, I'm really happy about the fact that we're actually getting some new build mode items, and that alone makes me happy. Okay, so let us move on to the buy mode, which we have. Oh my freaking goodness. We have one, two, three, four, five new beds. Oh my god. We have... Um, two new dining chairs okay let me just show you guys some of the items here okay let's turn off the grid here we have this gorgeous new bed and then another camping like bed thing <laughs> and then we have a beautiful chair over here a um, very ornate uh backrest and then that other one which has looks really really comfortable and i love the plaid pattern that it has this one also has the same plaid so we ha we're having a bit of continu continuity and then we have this one which has the ornate back and then we have a couple of benches as well oh not not a only a couple we have tons of benches and this set looks freaking awesome can people actually sit on these i think they can really really cool looking set love it and then for the outdoor um miscellaneous we have another oh it's an ottoman okay actually i haven't tried this yet but i'm guessing whether or not sims can sit on ottomans or not i hope they can i think they can because these looks like they're chosen but anyway okay that is it for comfort for surfaces we have okay some new coffee tables and then a new, oh two new dining tables actually this one looks very festive and then we have um an end table and a shelf oh my god this is the first time i'm actually seeing this one and then we have tons of new picnic outdoor related content this one has some food in it actually so really really cool and this one even has some foliage attached to it and then this one is a rock lol and then for plumbing we have you know all other new preferralia i guess and equipment actually it looks like every category has something new to offer um oh my god we have a new guitar <gasps> oh my god gaming table a bar and then i i, I don't think this came with did, did, did this came no i don't I stand corrected. I don't think this came with outdoor living, but we have brand new items that are exclusive 
to outdoor living when it comes to the gameplay aspects that they introduce and these are like coolers which acts as fridge and we have tents as well which we can be using for camping and we also have some fireplaces as well which I'm really really excited to see um, what kind of functionalities they introduce decorations of course we have tons and tons and tons of decorations um, you guys can see some of these actually come from the holidays um, update and stuff so so that that kids oh my god oh my god we have a new gnome and it is really cute oh oh my god it is so cute and it is a bear gnome actually it is a gnome dressed as a bear oh and we have tons of new lights which yeah okay we have this one oh that's really beautiful and we have some outdoor lamps as well electronics we have a new um, what is this one? A wall-mounted radio, I'm guessing, or stereo, or I don't know, whatever. Appliances, uh, literally, we have one fridge, but that is enough. At least we have a new one. At least we have new appliance. And then storage, we have, I think, yeah, we have a new closet as well. So, that's that. Um, I love how I literally didn't do anything to the house because we're dirt poor, okay? So what I'm actually going to do here is have both of them make out, uh, bro hug, and then um, tell an engaging story, and then let's see here, uh, kiss his cheek of course because they're kind of married, and then let's see what options she has when she's interacting with the phone. So these are the interactions that we're going to be getting right off the bat, okay? So clicking on the phone we have... Uh, Plan social event travel, household and entertainment, we can travel, and we can go on vacation. Yes, go on vacation with um, both of them, of course, and we are, we are legit doing this, you guys. We are legit going on vacation. Okay. She's going to grab her phone and call the travel agency to book a flight, to book some hotel rooms. And I think the loading screen is going to take us into choosing like a venue or something maybe. Oh my god, yes. Vacationing. Don't we have any tips or something? Do we have tips and stuff? I don't know. I don't think we have. Obviously, actually, okay, we did read the description of Granite Falls a while, a little bit um, a while ago, I guess, but yeah. This is, it looks like, well, it is obviously the main neighborhood within Granite Falls. So yes, we have the big park over here. And then we have, um, looks like five properties that we can rent. We have the campground, which costs 111 simoleons per day. We have the lakeside retreat, which costs 893 per day. Forest Hideaway, which costs 635 per day. We have the Riverside Retreat, which costs 282 per day. And we have the Green Getaway, which costs um, 397 per day. Actually, what I want to do is go camping. But before going... Actually, let's do that. Actually, you know what? I want to go prepared. So, what I'm actually going to do is cancel the vacation and purchase ourselves some new items. I love how he said that so randomly with a random tone and stuff. Okay, I want to purchase a new um, activities and skills, and I think it came with, I don't know, maybe recreation? Uh, I want to buy a new tent. Where can I plop in a new tent? Okay, we have a cabin in a bag. The cabin in a bag lets you bring all the comforts of home to a campsite. This large tent will easily accommodate you, your friends, and possibly a grizzly bear. No! Oh my god, and I think this is actually the... Okay, we are probably going to purchase this one because it looks cheaper. Easy Camper Tent. The Easy Camper is a small, sleek, and easy to assemble tent that makes roughing it feel not so rough at all. Okay, so we're gonna buy two of these. One for the girl and one for the boys. Alrighty, guys, we are back and these are the equipments that we're gonna be having for our trip out camping, I guess. 
or like I don't know trip abroad it's not necessarily I don't know whether whether it's abroad or not but anyway enough rambling hopefully we can put all these things in our inventory it looks like we can so she's gonna be um yeah she's gonna put these in her inventory and for some reason my game is like really really slow ignore that she's just gonna put these items in her inventory and then the boys are also gonna do the same thing obviously she gets to have the pink tent and the boys get to have the equally feminine <laughs> but you know blue tent but whatever ignore what i'm saying but yep uh let's have it put let's have him put it in his inventory for some reason my game is like not working or something not working properly or fluctuating or whatever but yeah my frame rate is like having a seizure right now so i guess what that means you guys is that is going to be it for this part okay guys um so where did she just go i'm like freaking confused but whatever you know what you guys i think i'm just gonna end this part right here okay guys so um i just want to thank you guys so much for watching and freezer bunny and i will see you guys in part two of let's play the sims 4 outdoor retreats okay guys bye